Hello, world. It is I. It is uh, Tuesday. Seniors Day. I'm at Value Village. I always say I don't come on Tuesdays, but I've been here the last, like, three Tuesdays in a row. I've got um, a tanning appointment at 11, so I figured might as well come kill half an hour here and then go to the tanning salon because we're just over a month away from Mexico. I'm stoked. Um, let's go inside and see what we got. There's another reseller here. This is a single stitch. Senza Pora. It says, those without a goal in life are destined to work for someone who does. That's some pretty uh, pretty woke shit right there. Single stitch. It's garbage. We're leaving it. Here's a bunch of late 2000s wrestling. John Cena, Never Give Up. You Can't See Me. Hulkamania. Printed tag. Another John Cena. I don't know what John Cena. Probably grab this early 2000 CSI. It's only three bucks worth. This is wildly fake Gucci. You can literally see the iron on transfer outline. That's crazy. It's on a, a super official intense 2XL. That's probably four or five thousand dollars. Might grab this giant Pumbaa plush. He's pretty cool. He's got bugs in his mouth. Seven ninety nine. Uh, I guess not. I guess these are all messed up. They're all cracked. I'll leave them. I guess. Picking up this Piero clown. He's from the eighties. I think it's a Mira Fujita. It's not worth that much. It's worth like forty bucks probably. I just think it's cool. I don't know something about it. it makes me want it. <clears throat> So I'm gonna see if Michelle will let me put it up in our house. If not, I'm gonna bring it to the booth. Hello world. Still Tuesday. I am now in Hamilton at Mission Thrift. It's uh, just before 12 o'clock. My tanning session was good. I swear to God, I'm not getting tanned at all. Look at how white I still am. So, I'm not sure. Like I went in for six minutes today, which is, I started out at four. Um, and I went in for six minutes and I still feel like I'm pale as a ghost, so. I'm gonna have to go up because we're just just about a month away. Um, anyways, let's go check out Mission Thrift. I found this gorgeous belt. It looks honestly like it's hand beaded. It's real cowhide. There's some like beads broken, which is part of the reason why I think it's hand beaded. It's only three dollars. So I think I'm gonna grab it. It's really cool. Here's a pretty cool 2000s Adidas. Fortunately, it's a youth size. Like so. And they got 20 bucks on it, which is nuts. So we're leaving it. There's some cool 2000s snow pants with the best company name I've ever heard. Check this out. Black Balls. That is a wild brand name. Here's a pretty nice The North Face. It's a high vent. I don't think it's fairly that great. Just a kind of generic. North Face, 20 bucks. I don't think it's worth it. To resell at least. Got a cool Molson Canadians Maple Leafs hat. It's uh, probably early 2000s. It's only three bucks. I'm gonna grab it. Here's some pretty cool dark ride plush. It's 18 bucks. There's sold comps all over the place. I can't decide. I don't think it's really worth it at 18 bucks. So I think I'm gonna skip. This is an m and Promo VHS. $1.99. There's a listing for $200 right now. Obviously, it's not worth that. But it's got to be worth something because it's sealed. Definitely sick. Here's a fake Sidney Crosby St. Patrick's Day. You can tell. The stitching there is not bad, but this has become my new giveaway. I guess I know you can never see it on camera, but the stitching goes literally straight across the logo, which is terrible. It's also disgustingly dirty. There's also this, which is a pretty big giveaway. They changed fabric to stitch in the back label because they obviously ran out. So this is a really bad fake. Cool jersey though. This is cool. This is a vintage North Park Trojans, which is the Branf one of Branford's high schools. Probably made, judging by the tag, I'm guessing 80s. Made in Branford, Ontario, which is my hometown. Tried it on and it doesn't fit. 
unfortunately. So we're gonna leave it. This is pretty cool. This is a Bosna. I don't know what it is. Bosna Hamilton 1998. This is truck training. But it's like a soccer jersey. The back's super faded, but it's 349. So I might grab it. This is a real jersey. It's a Vancouver Canucks Kessler jersey. It's in pretty rough shape though. A lot of the stitching's coming out. But 100% real. 25 bucks. Too much for me. We're leaving it. I'm gonna pick up this Budweiser King of Beers. It's got a hit on the sleeve. Definitely vintage. Uh, I'd say probably 2000s. 749 is not bad, so we're gonna grab that. This is a really cool Steelers sweater. It's just got a lot of stains on it. So, I think I'm gonna leave it. Also only a medium, so I am definitely gonna leave it. it. Just feels really high quality. Damn, found a Grateful Dead shirt, let's go. Unfortunately, it's from Old Navy. Apparently they had Grateful Dead shirts at Old Navy. Here's a pretty cool racing tee. Britney Force Monster Energy Top Fuel Dragster. It's only $4.99, probably gonna grab it. It's only from 2018, but still pretty sick. Here's a little single stitch joint. It says Assetti's number nine. It's on the Fruit of the Loom made in the USA. I don't think it's worth grabbing though. Single stitch all around. It's pretty clean, but I'm a pass. This is a low key funny. The Scottish kilt worn with pride. Celtic secrets they do hide. Merry Scotsmen show their knees and pray to God there is no breeze. <laughs> this is like 2000s. Not grabbing it, just funny. Here's a jean jacket. All it's got is this tiny Toronto Maple Leafs hit in terrible condition. Back's blank, everything else blank. $30, it's not even vintage. It's like 2011, 2012-ish. Here's a 2000s champion Green Bay Packers windbreaker. Back's blank other than the champion hit. And then it's got the champion on the sleeve. It's $24.99. I don't think I'm, I definitely don't think I can pay that. We're gonna pass. Okay, this is fire. Pretty sick biker jacket. This is Bristol on the sleeve. Look at the back. God damn. I just don't think I can pay $34.99 for this. I tried it on. It doesn't fit me. I don't know what I could get for it at the booth. Definitely not shipping it because it weighs 3,000 pounds. So, I think I'm gonna skip. There's a really nice 80s Avon sportswear. Never seen this tag before. It's got like two bulldogs on it. Cool, like winter chore jacket kind of, but 26 bucks, just nothing there for me. I really don't understand why all those people come from Hamilton to come to the one thrift store in Brantford. Like the thrifts here in Hamilton are way better and way more consistent. Every time I come here, I get stuff. When I'm in Brantford, I can go every day and get, you know, nothing. Like it literally doesn't make sense why they drive a half hour to come to one store when you can come to Hamilton here and there's like 10 thrift stores. But I don't know. I'm not them. Um, I'm now at Talese's. Upper James. This store is pretty cool. Their prices are usually pretty good. Um, don't, I haven't really gotten a ton of stuff here, but I don't come here too often, so let's go inside. This is a really cool 2000s Nike basketball gray tag. Really cool logo. But it's 12 bucks. That was way too much for me. I'm gonna leave it. They got some cool jerseys here. It's the OKC Durant. It's real. Pretty good, but $40 is crazy. Then they got a Clippers Kawhi jersey, which is also real. It's one of their cheaper, it's like a cheaper one, but it's still real. It's only, this one's actually $17, which isn't bad, but the it's been washed pretty bad, as you can see. Then they got a Cardinals jersey here. This one's also real. $34.99, which is crazy. 
Then back here, they got a Sherman Seahawks jersey, which is $39.99. This one's real, too. They're all real. They're all the same size. So they probably came from the same person, but their prices are tripping. This is the sickest, most adorable tiny jacket. Um, Michelle's cousin's having a baby, so I look in the, I've been looking in the kids section, but I think the baby's gonna be a long time from wearing this, so I'm not gonna grab it. These are pretty cool, 2000s Adidas. I like the colors, big hit on the back. It's the white tag Adidas. It's like early 2000s, but 17 bucks, I don't think so. Snowmageddon is officially here. It's Wednesday. Um, obviously, I didn't go out thrifting today. It's like three in the afternoon. And we've gotten like about a foot of snow, I would say, almost. Piper's stout. Piper loves the snow, which is weird because small dogs aren't usually super into the snow, but she'd get buried in it, but she loves it. So uh, yeah, I just figured I had to say goodbye. Um, you got this video and the next video are gonna be the last ones. Look, Piper can't even walk. This video and the next one are going to be the last ones for the giveaway. Um, make sure you comment down below your favorite thing I've picked up in the last couple months. And you're going to be entered to win completely free. Um, whatever that item is. Just for hanging out and being cool. Now, enjoy her jump through the snow. Look at how friggin' cute she is. Oh my god.